Hello, and today we're going to be trying something different. Last time the other mod pack didn't kind of end that well, so um, hopefully this will work a bit better if it hopefully loads. But okay, yeah, there we go. Everything's loaded. Okay, uh, this is this uh, mod pack called um, more questing. Okay, wow. This looks to be a bit more of an open-ended thing. So what does this do? Okay, this can I think this explains all the different blocks and stuff. Blocks and I okay, this just explains the stuff. I'll probably look through that if I need to find out, figure out anything. Uh, quest block. This should be the main thing about the, this uh, mod pack. It's it's meant essentially a whole bunch of different questing stuff. Okay, and just skimming through this, it looks like it's going to just say about um that this isn't quite finished yet and there's lots of different quest books that we can find might be a bit grindy but we'll see, we'll see what it results in so um, lives okay I ha I'm not having this as hardcore but I'll have an but we'll see how many times we end up dying party I don't think we can do anything with that yeah no I don't think we can uh, there we go go back uh, let's see quests um, yeah the basics there we go before we t dive too deep into the world of questing, let's focus on the essentials to get you started. Questline features vanilla X N Niho Tinker's construction. Okay, okay. Oh wow, that's quite a good quest. Okay, uh, these are probably going to be just killing stuff. Uh, yeah, it just looks a bit like killing stuff, but we'll see. Well, we'll probably start here. Okay, oh, just grab, grab the 16 logs. Okay, that should be fine. Nice to meet. And it is essentially, but from what I understand, it's an open world thing, and we kind of just complete quests, and it shows you what the mod pack has to offer. offer. So we're just gonna quickly get up six, get yeah, sixteen pieces of uh, wood. Okay, why are the fireworks? Oh, okay, probably from getting the achievement. We just got stuck. Okay, hopefully, probably sh yeah, I'll get an axe. Make things a bit quicker. Uh. Wood, the old wood. Bench making. Nope. There aren't more. Oh no, there is more fireworks. It, it spins a bit more. Yeah. No, it was just fire. Just for completing the achievement. So we make an axe and Okay, it just hasn't loaded. That's gonna be a bit annoying, but oh well. Yep, we've got an unloaded wooden axe. Curse of the invisible. Anyway, should be fine anyway. But it's just taking a bit of time to load in. Take that with us and hopefully fi finish the first quest soon. Uh, another one here. And I'll see you when we've got all 16 oak logs. And I'm back, we have 16 oak logs. One thing I noticed when getting there's different types of wood, so there's some sort of rubber wood as well. But we'll we'll, we'll see what it ends up with. But we should be able to complete the quest now. Claim rewards. Yeah, the back, so claim rewards. Yeah. Yeah, um we do not have to be handed in having them one in inventory, yeah. Yeah, I've got the rewards. Maybe just go back out and back in again. Oh, we're good to pick one? Oak planks or roll bag, I'd say. Because, no idea what that is, and the planks seem like, oh, you can just get more easily, so. Okay, we have a tune. Um, here we go, that should be that. Next is tools. Okay, this is not going to be helpful. You must craft the basic tools before you go anywhere. A task group, okay. It's a bit annoying that they're not loaded in, but at least I can see what they are. Shovel and pickaxe needed as well, that should be fine, nice and easy. Yeah, this is already going a lot better than the other one. Yeah, let's put on the wooden armor. It's weird, but let's see what the wood, wood, wood bag does. Um, cracked seared brick. Okay, it's an uncommon, but it doesn't seem to be anything special. Okay, there's a, another book as well. Uh, surviving the first day and beyond. Okay, it's probably just a bunch of recipes and stuff. We will be fine. I'll look at it if I need to. It's gonna be a bit annoying having that. 
I don't know why there's invisible stuff. But oh well. Um, I want a pick as, and a shovel. And a shovel. Lovely. Whole bunch of invisible stuff. I sure love having stuff I can't see. Okay. I don't know if it's just my computer not being able to deal with this or just like the mod pack is probably a bit buggy. Actually, probably the mod pack being a bit buggy because it is early access. Uh, next quest. Oh, you got to pick one a reward bag or a stone sword. I think for now I'm just gonna keep the uh, reward bags because they seem like they could be a bit fun and see if you get some random stuff. This, and you can get stuff like stone swords really easily. I've got the, I've got the stuff. Okay, go out, go back in, back to men okay, yep, yeah, I get it, yes, I'll go to quests, I've selected the reward bag, yes, what do you want? Okay, I just need cobblestone, uh, just gonna make a, okay, I just need a uh, 64 run, cobblestone, uh, pickaxe is there. Probably start um, mining downwards. From... Oh, we'll mine into the uh, mountain. Probably be more fun that way. Just gonna go in. Yeah, <laughs> not quite the. The nice thing is about the map is it shows you what entities there are around in the top right corner. And oh yes, coal is going to be useful. I'm going to try once again to see if I can get the uh, the, the thing back. The rewards for the last one because that would be kind of useful. Oh, wait, oh, there's another one. Oh, I need stone tools as well. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Okay, that makes a lot more sense at all. Bit stupid of me for not seeing that, but oh well. Uh, just got a bit of cobble and coal as well. That would be really useful. Just be, be gonna, I'm gonna need light, so. Wait, what's that? You need a... No, I can't harvest it. I need it. Harvest level redstone. Uh, maybe a stone protector will be enough to get it. Uh, here we go. Let's get the crafting table. Um, make a stone pickaxe to speed things up a tiny bit. Getting an upgrade. Lots of... Uh, Fireworks going to go off here? Nope, I'm not going to be able to get that. Probably going to need something like a redstone pickaxe from what I understand, but we'll see. Or maybe an iron pickaxe. Uh, just going to get these quickly, and we should be able to have enough for the tools. Okay, let's make some wood. Okay, probably going to need to get a bit of durability on the items so I can tell that they're there. So it would be nice to actually have it to not mess up. Actually, we're going to need a... No, I'm not going to need a wooden pickaxe. I'm going to need a stone pickaxe, a stone axe, and probably a stone shovel as well. That should probably hopefully complete the quest. And I can see these, which would be nice. Uh, let's put it there. Um, axe, I'll replace that. Um, shovel. So I put it in between there so I know about them and there we go. Uh, we should now be able to open the quest. Uh, yeah, one quest is for unclaimed, for unclaimed rewards. Which, yeah, okay. No, what? Why am I here? There we go. Okay, uh, reward bag. Don't need the stone sword. Yeah, and we've got torches. Okay, those are some interesting torches. Hmm, should I make? Oh, uh, nah, probably better to have a house. Might make here into a temp temporary, like, base, just to keep things going. Oh, wait, oh yeah, you can pick them up, that'll be fine. So if I just use those for now, keep it nice and bright. Uh, next quest, though. Probably need a stack of cob, right? Yeah, need a stack. And I guess it's an iron pick, so we know. And probably won't need another stack of uh, cobble as well, but. 
Let's just go get, not throw the pickaxe on the floor. Uh, checking there's nothing else I'm going to need. Yep, just that one. And I'll see you when I've gotten a stack of cobble. And it seems to be turning to nice oil. I'll do so I'll enclose myself here with, uh, yeah, just a bit. So it's going to be needed. So, get that piece. And we can close ourselves in and be safe with that. Hopefully the same thing won't happen as last time and we get completely stuck in here and not able to do anything, but hopefully you should be fine. Seems like a more easy going and less complicated mod pack than the other one where we're stuck constantly, but uh, let's get this and uh, quest book. Uh, reward bag done with a couple. And lovely tune and let's, what's the next one? Okay. Now we're opening up the stuff. The mine grind. Now that you've got the tools and a weapon, it's, it's time to get some resources. Oh god, that's a lot. Okay, so... Coal... Fuel... Well, yep, this is... We'll probably just get these over time, so I'm not going to focus on this. this that's going to be quite a lot. This will be quite useful. Um, as well as sieve... And a Tinker's Beginnings. Yeah, those should be nice and easy to do because I think I think they're probably going to be used in a lot of mod packs, so it should be nice to get uh, used to them. So it's time to start the Tinker's Construction. There are four important blocks you need to make first. Two of you are given in the given to you. The other two you must make yourself. The two you are given are part of the stencil capers and the part builder. Use um and the part uh. Yeah. Use uh, not a text. And it's probably just explaining what it is. In part of the, okay, so it's explaining what they're doing and if we just get the tour station and the packing chest we should be fine. Um tool space. Yeah, tool station needs that and what else? Yeah, if we just get those. Yeah. Make another what love one of these lovely invisible stuff. I really wish they weren't invisible. They would be really beautiful. Um, and make to another invisible thing. Oh, why do I keep on clicking that? Now we should hopefully have the stuff to make that, which is also invisible. This is lovely, thank you. I think we should be able to place it down if I haven't lost the thing. I think I may have lost the thing. Um, I think it's on the floor. <sighs> this is the problem with invisible stuff. I'm just gonna confirm that they don't like become visible when you throw them. Nope, they don't. All you get is small shadow. Lovely. Really lovely. So, let's, let's try and make another one of those. Don't know why it isn't working, but oh well. Okay, now it's showing. It's not letting me pick it up, I don't think. Well, that's fun, isn't it? Why is that? Maybe... Because the crafting table is there. The lock there. I don't know. And is the crafting table a bit invisible now as well? Or have I lost it? I think I've lost it. Lovely. Oh wait, I think I might. Nope. Have I got it? No. Yeah, never mind. It isn't invisible. <sighs> this is not fun. No. <laughs> Crafting table hopefully will work better this time. So make that like that. Oh you can have wooden shields, that's nice. Okay. Yay, got the blank patterns this time. Uh just make another crafting table. Okay, got a new achievement, more fireworks. Uh crafting table, crafting table, blank pattern, tool station, nice. Mm. 
and tag. Uh, we're gonna need one other thing as well. Can I make this into a permanent base? It's not the nice things though, that's the problem. And you could be horse that I can't mine. So maybe not. And never mind, that's quite a few mobs we've got on the map. Anyway, let's get on with the um, making. Wait, what's this? Oh wow, there's lots of other stuff as well. Okay. No idea what it's going to show as well, and lots of stuff I haven't seen before. Uh, quest book. Let's see. Nope, not, don't want to go there. Quest book. We want a packing chest, is the other thing. Uh, make that. Go. Packing chest. Packing chest. I think, from what I understand, um. Okay. The reason why I didn't show before is because I haven't made made them. Yeah, and I need to make a chest. Okay, never mind. That makes a lot more sense now, I think. Okay, so if I make that, I can then make a chest. And make... You can, you can make some more chests, okay. Okay, and that should be the quest done. Hopefully. Yep, that's done, and you get to click up. Materials and you, Volume 1. I thought I have one of those. Don't I? No, it's Volume 2. Uh, m material, materials and you, Volume 1. No, I have that. Never mind, I don't need that. Oh yeah, we should open these. Those will be fun. Okay, please give something good. Oh, yay. Lovely stuff that I don't need. Sulfur. No idea what that's going to be used for. Uh, they don't seem to be anything that amazing, but it's still fun to see what they have. It helps show me parts of the thing I haven't, and the rest of them I can make or get. So. Actually, it would be nice to have the duplicates of them, never mind. Because then they have the two, but oh well. Uh, let's see. Next quest Iron Grout. To progress in the Tinker's construction, I will need Grout to play anywhere. How do we get grout? No idea. Uh, probably check that out. Yeah. Let's do the sieve. Okay. Chest or strings? Uh, you can put gravel, sand, dirt, dust, and even netherrack into the sieve. And right click it to shift, sift for broken pieces of ore, and which can be smelted into materials. This is a great way of getting a supply of resources. Okay. The sieve. Let's make one then. It'll probably be easy to go oak. Oak, sip. Yeah, there we are. Okay, what? Silk mesh. How do you get that? You get silk mesh by getting string. For that, you need string. But there, there should be spiders. Oh, unfortunately, ah, I see one spider. That's not very useful. Okay, um. Uh, I'm gonna quickly have a look, see if I can find, um, find the, uh, what's it called, whatever, um, grout is, and once I have, I'll be back on, and we can continue. Okay, I uh, fi figured out how to do it, and we, well, not figured out, I found out how to do it, we need clay, sand, and gravel. Oh yeah, I could have just searched that up in there, never mind, oh well. Oh wait, that's marble. Okay, um... Should I risk going outside? Is it worth it? Probably not. But, oh yeah, oh yeah, I should probably put these down. And I can open up my other thing as well, so... Probably need to make... I'll probably make a house, uh, when... Instead of continuing with the storyline next. Uh, because it'd be nicer to have a better base. Okay, we need powder. Nice to know, like, what half the things we can do. Enderman. It is nice, though, to have the map. Um, no, I'm gonna risk outside. Just almost. Oh, wait, oh, it's day. Okay, uh, gravel, clay, and sand is what I need. Let's quickly get the gravel. I don't know how much clay's needed. Uh, I should probably check that. 
Uh, probably not while submerged in the water, so I don't drown. Um, oh, 32, so... Um, How do I spell this again? It is G R. There we go. Grout. Uh, one four. Okay, so that bit. But not okay. Uh, nope. That's dirt. Oh yeah, more gravel there, and we're going to need sand. Uh, but then we should be good. Hopefully we may find some spiders as well, which we can use. Uh, no, that's marble. Clay. And sand. There's sand. What's that? So this is... Oh, pumpkins as well. Round garden. Uh, what are those? Rugata. Okay, probably some sort of vegetable or something like that. Uh, which we can probably use to grow as well. And gooseberries, okay, nice. Fun. Uh, maybe that isn't ripe yet or something. I don't know, I'll leave them for now. Uh, wait, is that clay? I think that's clay, yep, clay. Let's quickly get that. You don't need a lot of clay, probably more than this though. Uh, once we got that though, it should be fine. Oh yeah, sand as well. We need clay and sand. So hopefully the... What's that? I swear, I'm going to keep on going in this mod pack. Just go, ooh, what's that? Ooh, what's that? Um, that is mush a mushroom garden. Okay, you can get mushrooms to break me. I'll just leave those. Take those. Am I already out of space? Um... I don't think the that. There we go. Um, gonna need space for the sand as well. I already ran out of space. I don't need a wooden pick. Uh, if we get a piece of sand so that it doesn't go back into my inventory. Okay. It's gonna be annoying having the half hidden stuff, but should be fine. Hopefully we can make some of the grout soon. Yeah, is that that's probably gonna be enough sand. Maybe get a bit more. Better to have more than not enough. Yeah. We're gonna need more than half a stack though, so actually I'm gonna need quite a bit more. Well I'll start making yeah, some of this. Um and start making a bit of a base as well. Uh, find out space again. What I'll do is I'll make these all into wood. Uh, uh, what else do I not need? I don't need a wooden axe. There we go. Um, actually, we will start making a ha uh, house or something, maybe. Yeah. No, probably. Or a bit, get a bit more gravity first. Now we're gonna need to set up a proper base, so we may as well start working on that, and we can move our stuff over once I've, once we've started to build it. Uh, let's see. Let's see one moment. There we go. Okay. Uh, or we could leave it for the next episode. Actually, I'll um I'll, I'll start the foundations of the house. We will probably want it to be high up or something like that. Um. Let's see what's up. Let's see up here. That should be a nice place. Uh, probably a new flower. Yep, mystical blue flower. Probably should break that. Nope. Okay, I'll just put down. Oh, new achievement. Sky beginning. Okay. I'll just put that down. I don't really know what it's supposed to do. Um, but if we get up here, we can flatten out this area. And then we could probably end it here, uh, end this episode here. I think I'm probably going to continue this mod pack. It's a nice fun mod pack. It teaches the way. It teaches me how to do stuff. It's not just so I'm not just constantly failing at everything. And it should be fun. Yeah, this should be a good foundation. 
Why aren't I using my uh, shovel? Yeah, that's probably good enough. Let's start placing the um, grid for the house. Because the nice thing with the smoke pack is we can do what we want. There's no like, oh, you have to start doing this instantly, or oh no, you're you're gonna have messed everything up and you can't continue like the other one, which wasn't the nicest of feelings. <laughs> but we should be fine. Uh, yeah, we do do that. Pick up that. Uh, flash another candle, but no. Probably need to harvest the tree. Uh, uh, yeah, let's make a uh, crafting table. Oh well, I've already got one, but it's the problem with having more than one. Okay, and then we can use that to make a chest. Right. <laughs> Second. Where's my wood one? Okay, that's my wood stick. It's a good sign. Okay, make a chest and we can put everything. Two chests actually, probably best to do that. And we can just put everything in here. Uh, oh, should take it. Nope. Okay, never mind, I'll just do it all manually. Hopefully. This should be good by the next. Oh, okay, I can just hold shift and just put it in. Okay, I don't have to do it. Okay, uh, get out the wood and the dirt and just carry on building out the bases. Probably end the episode soon after we build this out. And we should have a nice how We should have a nice, fa nice foundation to finish the house in. And. We can, and if you give me suggestions on what to do, we can do it within the world. It'd be nice and fun. Oh, I nearly lost my hole. <laughs> okay, just. Okay. Um. But actually, what I'll do is I'll probably do this offline, uh, get the foundation and maybe a bit of the house built, and I'll see you next episode.